Hello everyone and welcome back to Kerbal Space Program. My name is Mephisto and today we're going to be trying to shoot for... Well, hopefully, I'm hoping to shoot for the North Pole, but I've got this thing all buggery buggery. One more time. This time we're going to shove all of our engines whoop, onto this area. That one right there. Fire! Oh my god, the power! The sound of a hundred engines firing at once. It fills a man with power. And yes, I know it's wobbling ever so slightly to the south. I think, yeah, to the south. But that's okay. said all that. A little bit further. A little bit further. No, 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 no. No, a little bit that way. And perfect. Fire! Oh, crap. Come on, kill it, kill it, kill it. Up we go, up we go, up we go, up we go. Staying just above the horizon. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Slow it down. Okay, what are we on? Are we on west? I think we're west. And where we want to be is south. First, we need to re I need to recorrect this whole thing. I need to recorrect all of this. One now. Come on now. Come on. Come on. Freaking gyroscopes. Okay. So that's west. It means that that's east. I hope. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, lord. Nope. Nope. Oh, lord. Like, this, this is a lot more complex to control than it looks. I promise you. But don't worry, Jebediah. We will get either to the North Pole or into orbit. Okay. Settle it down, settle it down, settle it down, settle it down. Okay, now all we have to do is go back up. And to the right, and have a little bit more, and to the right still, and right there. Perfect. That is exactly what I wanted. Full thrust! The ultimate goal here is basically to try and make it, make an orbit with only that much fuel. And it has been a challenge so far, believe me. Just got all my science stuff. 
No, I haven't. Okay. Observe the goo. Yay, log that. Log log the pressure. And log the temperature. See, so here's my problem. I can get up to here. On what fuel I have in this thing. But then it stops. And this rocket's not actually supposed to be... Not actually supposed to do all that much. So this rocket, really what we want is a way to get back home. Okay, cool. So we've officially made an orbit. So we've officially made an orbit around the planet while still having an ability to get an astronaut back home. I'm sorry, Valentina. Okay, you know what, though? We're gonna go back to, uh... We're going back to, uh... Uh... <laughs> we're gonna go back to our main area here. Uh, nope. Let's go ahead and double-check on that one, actually. Look at it, it's so cute! Went so fast, too. Um, no. View. Oh, that'd be so cool. I can no longer, however, apparently take a, uh... I apparently can no longer take a... Crew report. At all. Anyway, yeah, so there you go. That is a true orbit with enough fuel to take someone, well, at least mostly push them back home. So you're going to disable the SAS on this one. Uh, can I take control? Resuming control, please. Okay, am I no longer in control of this vessel? Oh wait, why? I know why. Because I can't control it while it's, um, uh... I can't control it while we're under the effects of my time warping. Well, Jebediah, you are officially the finest crewman I, crew member I have. That is a glossary, go away. Space program have attracted contributions from numerous organizations. We have entered orbit. Woohoo! Uh, direct connection to space. Nope. Um. No, yeah, no, I can't transmit science. Space Center! Okay, we're gonna leave him up there because we've got a new project. So we've got a new project. So we're just gonna leave poor Jebediah up there for the moment. We don't need anything this ostentatious, so new. This one's gonna have, oops. This one's going to have a relatively similar purpose. Except we're only going suborbital with this one. What we're gonna do is, of course, a heat shield. As we come back, a decoupler. What about six? Oops. What about six of these? Six. Yep. 
Just that. Okay. And on this we want... We want four of these babies. Curbs. Explorer. Knew you all thought you all thought, thought I was gonna type exploder, didn't you? See, I know y'all. I know y'all. You're evil. All right. All right, Bill. You're an engineer. An operational SAS module and no pilots aboard. What? Oh well. Okay. So our goal. Is here. Okay. This is not going to be good though. So I actually have to control this thing manually. This little SOB does not control well. Okay. Now that we've gotten you semi under control again. Alright. I don't have any friggin' SAS somehow. Alright, because you're not a pilot. this way and we need to go like this and we need to correct the roll. Nope, nope, nope. Problem is I have to do all this manually. As my only two pilots, Jebediah and Valentina, are up in space. Okay, now hopefully that'll do me for a while. That is worse than worse. That means that I literally have to do the whole retrograde. The thing that controls like a like the backside of a donkey. Hopefully. Hopefully once gravity takes over.
Here's the problem, keyboard sensitivity is virtually non-existent. Oh, I hate not having a pilot. Oh, this is awful. Uh-oh. That's worse. I can't... I can't bring her into a retrograde. So she's just spinning until... Oh, thank you. Thank you, heaven, for allowing gravity to give me some mercy. Woo. Don't jettison the heat shield. Crew report. Great view of the Highlands. Freaking wonderful. So from this one, I'm getting literally nothing. I said that didn't matter. Deploy those first two parachutes. Deploy the final one. Explosions! Lots of them. Alright, so what we can do is now we can jettison the heat shield. Oh. Oh, this is gonna suck. Please don't roll. Oh, thank you. I mean, you're rotating for some reason, but whatever. And I said, just let go. That's not worth it. EVA report. Let's still take it anyway. All right. Cover vessel. So, we've done a lot. Yeah, I know. Cover vessel that survived a flight. Next, we're going to go to the tracking station. We're going to... We're going to control the science fly. Now. Where are we, Jebediah? I'd rather you land over land. Preferably on the light side of the planet. Alright, you know what? I know what we're gonna do. And we're going to slow it down here. No. Okay. We right over an area we want to be. Yes, we are. Just fly straight down at it. Ah, crap. We're not going to come in for a landing, are we? Uh-oh. Excellent. Uh-oh. That's not good. This, however, could prove out to be very, very, very fruitful. Okay. Fire off the first two parachutes. Final parachute. Final parachute will deploy any day now, I hope. Okay. 
So with that done, we're going to cut that one. And we're going to cut this one. And now we're just going to wait for it to set down into the water. Jebediah is safe, everyone. A complete mission success of making it into a wonderful and stable, which is the most important part, orbit, while having enough fuel to jettison back down to the planet. And we landed safely. Whoa, graphics are out a little bit, though. Recover the vessel. Wow. Holy! Recovery of vessel from orbit. Temperature scan while in space. Atmospheric pressure scan while in space. Mystery goo observation while in space. We got so much for that. And then we got some parts for that. And then he got... Ooh, he's ready to advance to level 1. Nice. And we got 36 reputation. Holy crap. Uh, astronaut complex. Uh, yeah, she's still... I feel sorry for them. I feel sorry for her most of all. We return to orbit, we get into orbit, and we return to the surface from orbit. Yeah! Now, I could do some more researching of science and stuff, but I've got to go because I've got stuff to do and I've got to prepare for tomorrow. So, thank you guys for watching this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, then smash the like button, leave a comment, share the episode to friends, family, gamers, anybody else. And if you're not already, then consider hitting subscribe to stay up to date on all the cool things we're doing in the future. Anyway, I've been Mephisto. This has been Kerbal Space Program, and I'll see you guys two weeks from now. Later!